last year you forgot to celebrate your loved one on their birthday and i don't know why you actually had to do that so please this year make sure you are not making that same mistake and because i do not want you to forget that i am making this tutorial so you can create something special for them because everyone deserves to feel special on their birthday okay so what you see on your screen is what we are going to be creating in this tutorial and yes if this is your first time on my channel or this is the first time you are seeing my face please subscribe to this channel because we want to hit a hundred thousand subscribers by the end of the year so join us and let's grow this family together if you're on the free version of canva look you can upgrade to canva pro for free i have a link in the description box below that can help you do that so i think that's enough let's dive into the tutorial So the first thing we are going to do is creating a new design. So come to create a design then come to custom size. Okay, then set the width to 1080 and the height to 1350. After you do this, make sure it's on pixels. Okay, then create new design. Click on that. Okay, when you do this, you should see something like this. Very easy and very what? Simple. Yeah. Anyway, so what we are simply going to do is to start with the background. So we'll come to color and it's already on white. So the first color we are going to choose is let me actually choose the color so that you don't struggle. Okay. So I would come into new color is F A B F B F. Okay. Then we come to gradient. Okay. Then all we need is a two color gradient. So the second color we are going to set it to white all right then with the style make sure you're looking for the circular gradient click on that and you can see the purple comes first or the pink sorry pink to white but we want white to pink okay uh -huh. so something like this after you do that make sure you're coming to element and search for sun burst okay so sun burst you should see this element so select the white one and increase the size you can see what we have over here very very beautiful okay after you do that come back into element and search for rules okay and there are going to be so many rules but depending on who you are designing this for this is actually for a lady okay so you would want to choose you can choose the red rules but everything will have to be red on the design okay but we are going with the pink rules all right yeah i love i love this rose it's looking very beautiful it looks like the rose is the sun true and yeah that's pretty true okay so after you do this make sure you're adding the photo of your special person so if it's a lady a little girl make sure you're doing that okay but in my case i am going to come here into my element come to recently used no not you going into recently used. i have to go into recently used. okay and find this lady in here okay she is the crush of the day so I will select the image, come to edit photo and come to BG remover to allow Canva to remove the background. And this is a Canva Pro feature. So if you are still in the free version, remember there's a link in the description box below that can help you upgrade to Canva Pro for free. So make sure you're checking it out and well, let's get these things sorted. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, so we are going to increase you know, the size and we are just also going to make sure she is the main attention on the design okay then we crop it then i think we should make this bigger a little bit okay yeah this is so so nice anyway so we want to make sure the photo you know just to punch the colors and all that so we'll come into edit photo and in edit photo come to adjust over here we are going to tweak some of these settings okay so the brightness i'll punch it up a little bit the contrast also come up a little bit okay this actually separate the lights from the from the dark so that everything is looking very um clear then the white will boost a little bit to boost the white the black will also come up a little bit okay just to make the blacks blacker then <clears throat> we come to saturation boost it to make the color pop okay so you can see how it's looking right now then we can increase the vibrance a little bit okay just to uh, motivate the low colors to come up a little bit then the sharpness just a little bit okay yeah something like this is fine then i think we have something looking good right now so the background rules okay duplicate it and you can position one over here come to edit photo and you should find blur click on it then come to whole image and increase the intensity okay so something like this should be fine then we can duplicate this and maybe position it also over here come to flip flip it okay duplicate it and what we can do is we can make this one smaller okay then position it here i know it should load but i don't know why it's not showing but it will definitely 
show so don't you worry okay so you can see it just came nice one if you want to cover everything over here you can just do that something like this it's still looking beautiful okay so yeah then what we are going to do next is to add the text so press t on your keyboard to add the text in case it's at the top it's okay it's okay yeah. wait move it to the top don't increase it to the top okay yeah then we are just simply going to see birthday okay so birthday okay then we select everything and increase the size okay so i remove the one b select or come to canva sounds and i'm going to choose the rebel font okay so you can see we have the same font over here then we'll increase the size bring it here then i think the row should come down a little bit okay so that we can accommodate the text okay so the text will also go behind here so do this by right clicking come to layer show layers okay then we move this behind the lady okay something like this beautiful beautiful okay then duplicate it by using ctrl d and you can reduce the size okay then i'm going to slant it a little bit and now you say happy okay so happy birthday to you stop it get some help we, you like my voice then we'll select the two of them come to the color and we're going to change the color okay once you add the rules you should find colors you know some nice colors in here so i think this looks good to me i, I think i like what i'm seeing so i'll basically select everything and drop it down a little bit okay then duplicate this and i'll put this one also over here duplicate it again and maybe put this one also over here like this then the next thing we are going to do is to press t on our keyboard again okay and we are going to mention her name so maybe let's say her name is estelle okay estelle dash d a l c y okay so we select everything and make it bigger then the alignment we are going to you know move everything to the left and make it all caps okay then come to the typeface then choose lee gothic okay so once you choose lee gothic come to the spacing and reduce the line spacing to something like this then the next thing you're going to do increase the size more again then come to the color you can choose any beautiful color i'm using this brown which is 9c5440 then come to effect make sure you're choosing the outline and the outline you can make the color white okay then you're just simply going to reduce the thickness of it okay so something like this is beautiful then we position it here choose you know these two um roses then bring it in front of the text okay so we have something beautiful like this then press r on the keyboard okay so something like this reduce it then we are just going to pull it like this uh -huh. and we'll change the color of this as well but before we do that come to border style then come choose this line then add your corner rounding okay move it to like 16 then come to the border color and choose white for it you come to the main color and choose any of these pinky colors for it okay all we are simply going to do is to add our um happy birthday text okay so i'll press t on my keyboard and i'll change this to poppins okay so poppins and make sure everything is looking good okay then we are going to select the regular and make sure everything is selected and also make sure we are deselecting the uppercase um, option over here make it small and add your birthday wish okay so this is my birthday wish okay so we'll reduce the size and maybe let me just stretch this a little bit then move this you know to the center and would we'll also change the alignment okay lovely javelin okay then we can maybe increase the size a little bit more so once you do that let's come to the text color and change it to white so this is what we have at the what moment okay so we can see we are getting close in or getting closer to the finish line one last thing is to put the dates of birth in there so press circle what no press c on the keyboard not circle okay then we will reduce the size to something like this and for the bed months we are just going to that's what we are just going to do right now okay so i'll reduce the size and i'll change the color to this pink we have over here then i'll duplicate this okay and position it right on top then we would increase the size but i'll change this to white okay so to white and i'll make sure i'm sending it back okay so i'll come to layers and i'll move it behind this one okay so we have something like this and make sure everything is positioned nicely then what we are going to do is i'll duplicate this okay and i'll change the color to match this brown over here lovely javelin 
then maybe if her birthday was in june they're just going to put june in here okay so you can say june then duplicate you know then make a space and say june again and that's what we are going to say okay then select or come to effect and come to curve okay so in curve we want this to be a round circle okay so something like this then we would increase the size position it right here so you can see this is what we have then we can duplicate this okay and we'll make it 15 okay so let's say bed was from 15 to june this is what we are going to do okay so we just put it here and you can see this is looking beautiful and yes this is what we wanted to create in canva and we have been able to create it inside of canva i hope you found it helpful i hope you found it easy if you did please hit on the like button share this video with your friend you know a friend <laughs> yeah and yes just in case you have any tutorial you want me to create, kindly leave it in the comment section below. The name is Benjamin Osh. Remember, there is no limit to creativity. Subscribe and I should see you in my next video. Peace.